Well, hey guys, welcome to ADD POV. Today we're going to unbrick a Thrustmaster Warthog Hotus. All right, guys, so we've got it flipped over. We've taken the backboards off, which is just five screws. Next, you're going to need your part, which you can order from Thrustmaster themselves from the support group. So, this has just arrived today after a few months. Uh, when I say a few months, I think two months. So, there's the new board, all nicely wrapped up, new cable, ready to go. And as you can see, they really do wrap it up really nicely. At least in shipping, it doesn't get damaged. But hey, we just hope that this is the part we need to fix everything. Okay, a little tool set out. Start, Let's take these four screws out. And to take this very carefully and place that in there and you're gonna put these pins on these pins straight and parallel with the board straight down like that make sure you're not pinching any of the cables there we go that is on there we go you can take your screws I suggest you place the screws first about halfway all four of them because you can see there's a bit of pressure here so this is obviously not soldered as straight as it should be you just hold it with your thumb until it's all nicely level release the pressure and then tighten them all together Cool. Right, next step is going to be to take these pins. I'm going to put them all back in one by one. Right, <clears throat> so now once that's done, you should have everything in place here. This guy over here needs to go to... I think what we must do is make a little notch over here. Right, and then we'll just put these screws back in. Right. Right, and now we saw if this actually worked oh and just like that I saved it no longer dead ta-da boom so as you can see all the uh, control surfaces are working Well, thanks guys for watching. See you in the next one.